Hello everyone, today I have a new Rick Owens item that I purchased. Dark Shadow, a pair of trousers that I've already wanted for quite some time. I hope it is a thing, because on Ukes, where I bought this thing, um, it's not quite clear to me yet what the product codes mean, and because you need to be fast, because you don't know whether someone else is looking at this item or not. You have to be fast to side fast, and um, I thought, well, I can just send it back, no problem. I'll take a guess. So, first impression, just out of the box, haven't seen it yet. I'll let you know what I think of it. Right, so having a look at this, the usual, the usual white wrapping. The fabric feels like a thin cotton. I uh, had read that it was 100% cotton. Um, my concern is that it will not be um, thick enough for me to personally enjoy. And by the first looks of it, I'll have to try it on and see what I think of it because it's um, it's the same cotton as uh, my prisoner trousers, which is pretty lightweight. Maybe this is a little less see-through. No, it's it's exactly the same in my opinion. Um, it's a size large. It's one hundred percent cotton. And let's see, there's a code in here. You can check out. Um, yeah, it's um. DU and then 19S4374RN. Um, There's some lists on Reddit, I think, where you can see what that actually means and, um, well, should feel like or what you can expect. It's really long, pretty big, because I bought my prisoner trousers in a size medium, and I sometimes feel like that's just a little bit too slim looking for me. So I figured that I would have preferred a size large in the prisoner trousers in dark shadow i'm not totally sure if i'm going to keep this yet because um yeah just sharing the information about this and i hope it works because every single time i purchase something i have the hope of it like completely working for my wardrobe i'll just put it on show you guys what it looks like and i'll let you know a little bit more what i think about it and how it fits feels so here we'll just have a look at what it looks like and it's just it's really comfortable it's a basic, it's just a basic, um, the sizing is perfect, I feel like this large fits better than the uh, prisoner trousers from Dark Shadow in uh, size medium, so I think my Dark Shadow trouser size is a size large, and uh, it means that the fabric, it's not maybe something that you want to be, like, coming outside with i don't know it's um it, it's pretty basic and it, it looks so joggy the prisoner trousers is a different yeah a little bit of a different model just with that elastic at the bottom but it does feel like that's just something different it has the back pockets and yeah it's um i'm a little bit on the fence about this um but again i will uh, think about it for some time and I uh, use my return time to uh, think about this purchase and I will try them on with a few different sneakers and the jacket maybe a full outfit so we can see maybe if it works for me maybe then it clicks um, better and yeah just see how it connects to my sneakers in terms of the width and the crossover effect that I most likely do I like the trousers it's 200 euros and yeah i'm just used to getting really good deals this was fine in my opinion but i do have to like it a lot for it to be fine for this price now that i have it so let's pick a few sneakers from the uh, wardrobe and uh, have a look at what coats i can wear. here we have a few sneakers that i want to um try out and i think uh, this would be like a few of my sneakers that I feel like it has to connect with in order for me to keep this purchase. Um, now it's just, um, uh, we, I don't have so much to trade in like, uh, anymore in means of clothing, um, in means of selling it. And um, I don't know if I want to trade in anything for this or if I just say, well, you know, 20 euros for this pair of dark shadow trousers, a little bit less. Um, I'll have to see. So we'll try um, the geo baskets first. And some people have been asking for a, um, a shoe collection video, <laughs> updated one. 
which I'm fine with. I, uh, I've written a script for that. Um, maybe a little bit like a video essay on how it just came to be like this. And I think what maybe will look nice with this is the um, the geo basket look. And then maybe a lot of fabric here. I feel like this has to be an outfit that works. And I like what I like what I'm seeing. And that's because it has a, a really low crotch. Here are my knees, and here is the crotch. I don't know if that's usually the case with my Rick Owens trousers. I never really look at it like that. Um, this looks good. Um, so this has a, um, let me just scratch this off of the list. This is good. Um, let's have a look with um, my trusted bomber. I could really understand if you guys have grown a little bit tired of this bomber. Um, I don't know if you can understand completely what you're seeing. And um, this is a, well, it might be a wearable material outside. This is good for a t-shirt. But now it just kind of looks like I'm wearing a sweatsuit. And that's maybe not the look <laughs> that I want for this. And I also have these exact trousers in mainline. They were half the price and that's, um, yeah, I will probably not find that again for that price. Um, but you can see difference. That's a little bit more uh, shining and a different material. Not as comfortable. That's important to say because I also feel like you should be comfortable in your clothing. But now when I'm looking down, I can imagine wearing this. And this piece would probably mean more to me than a pair of uh, wear three shorts or uh, my Hoopa Air trousers that I purchased. I haven't worn once since I made that video. Maybe not the best purchase of this year. <laughs> um, yeah, let's have a look at a few different sneakers again and um, we'll get to a verdict pretty quick. Righty, righty, let's get the, the seven centimeter soles to the front of the stage. These are really tough in means of uh, material. Um, Feel like really good quality yeah look good great all right and then we get this one yeah these are heavy but if you would kick someone with these it would hurt quite a bit but yeah don't do that all right this looks great i love this so we get a second check that was pretty quick um, I could just tell that this is good. Um, it cuts off at the right length for me at where the sneakers are. It has enough fabric around it to make it work for me because otherwise it looks like a regular pair of trousers. And this way I feel like it's just a little bit different. I like the longer laces. I don't know if they're longer than my other trousers, but sometimes you have the longer shirts and then you only see like a little bit of lace. I don't like that. I like laces. Also here where you could maybe try it. A little more relaxed look yeah and this is a look where i would need that 139 deck or december jacket um to uh make it like really work because it's a pretty basic leather jacket in my opinion i kind of switched uh my mood basically for this i need a more extravagant leather jacket and more extravagant outerwear pieces yeah so looks good um second check for the uh, trousers starting to like them and nobody requested this but i was quite very close to what this would look like this yeah this is so gimmicky like i'm an action figure what do you guys think rocket man 3m jacket with uh alexander wang <laughs> it's ridiculous probably wouldn't wear it like this so let's see, maybe some easy sneakers. These have been a good buddy of mine uh, these last few weeks. And I like that it doesn't have a cuff right now. Of course, I wouldn't want to wear it like this. <laughs> well, no, this is just, yeah, this is too, too Instagram for me to cut it off like that. I feel like it, I'm not sure. <laughs> they look like really weird. Um, um, slippers, slip-ons, this is more of it. Um, I don't know if it has enough fabric to do the, the trick for me with this, this pair. Well, again, it's fine. This is fine. 
All right, so this is quite easy. Um, don't need to really wear a coat or jacket with this one. Um, so yeah, this is quite an easy pair, and I'm starting to like this uh, more and more actually. Um, yeah, and this is just a new pickup method for me to show you what I think and where I um, maybe draw the line sometimes for myself to see if I really like the purchase or not. And um, it's going in the right direction. <laughs> you probably noticed that. Um, I want to try it with some sock sneakers as well. Um, and not necessarily, not necessarily um, only the mustard ones, but also these. And this is a bit difficult because this is a really skinny sneaker. I don't know if this would work as, as well. But there we go. We have this. Not too much fabric in the sock for my liking. And then stack from above. I think this is going to work too. It's like an infinite pool of black fabric right now. And I pull um, the sock sneakers uh, on feeling. I'm really careful with my stuff, so don't, yeah, don't worry about me. Yeah, this is cool too. Like this. Looks good uh, with a double bumper. The fabric is contrasting. Yeah, you can't tell on video, I think. You should visit me in real life um, or see me in real life. This works well, uh, which um, will also make me presume that mustard oils will work well. Let's try some low tops because I don't know how that looks. And yeah, low tops are not my favorite pair of sneakers, always high tops. Um, yeah. So this, yeah, it's a good pair of trousers and this is a find that happens because I check on, well, routine basically. My life is programmed on um, finding deals actually. So what happened was I was playing Warzone and after that um, I was just browsing, browsing while I was in the lobby and I saw that there were um, a new number of items at my premiere and premiere is your like saved settings for your searches so for me, uh, for me it's every Rick Owens collab Dark Shadow and Mainline all of those combined and you can just if you see every day you know if it's either 900, 914, 950 or 1000 or 1200 all of a sudden that's when you know you have to look and if you like kind of get into that and see what new items are there all the time at latest arrivals and you see the amount going up and there's nothing new at the latest arrivals there's probably something sent back and it could be something that you haven't seen before which is this so yeah that's how i found this um this is okay um i don't know maybe i'm just growing well, just straving away a little bit from these sneakers. I don't really like, don't really like this look, but it works in means of how much fabric there is at the bottom. That's why I like the size large as well. All right, so Ramones, vegan ones, and then we'll uh, end up with the uh, mustard on socks. We'll have a look at what that looks like, feels like. These are always so comfortable. This is like the one of my impulse purchases that completely paid off. I don't know. It's fine. Um, maybe not like this. Maybe I need to wear something more with this. And these are not outfits that I wear on the streets. Well, I mean, not if I would try a little bit more. It's just. Me wearing the same shirt over and over again, trying different sneakers with the same pair of trousers and this jacket all of a sudden. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't really, no, I wouldn't wear it with these sneakers, I think. Looks too, too simple. Yeah, this wouldn't work for me, I think. Not at this moment, at least. So, we'll try the mustard ones and um, probably call it a day and the verdict should be quite clear. So... 
I love Ukes. Um, I talk about Ukes all the time. I share deals um, for Ukes all the time. And it's just a great concept. I love it. I find great deals. Um, and I'll show you all the good things that I actually found on Ukes. Um, yeah, I also missed out on tons of stuff on Ukes just because of festivals and wasn't money ready for certain purchases um if you guys maybe remember i had that um julius army trouser the waxed wool version in a size two i purchased at supermarket amsterdam then i started going to the gym gained 12 to 13 kilos first because i finally started eating more <laughs> because i was really skinny before and um i didn't fit anymore into these trousers so i sold them but i always loved the look it was really impressive and it doesn't matter where you go with julius army or cargo trousers people will say something about it and it doesn't matter what but it's always a subject to talk about and i just i love the look i felt really confident in those yeah, and this it's just just enough no 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 it's not um, I don't feel like there's enough fabric here to make it work. It's just too too skin tight around here. Maybe if I wear them a little bit lower, that there's more fabric. I don't know. I don't know if I like this uh, the best. No, this is uh, I think one of my uh, well non favorite looks. So this would probably not be it for me. And yeah. I've tried it with a few sneakers now, so you can probably tell what uh, what kind of outfits I would wear with it. And um, yeah, so Raycon Star Shadow trousers, a little bit under 200 euro shipped uh, on Ukes. Check it out. Also for Black Friday, might be really interesting this year because they're starting early, do extra discounts and the free shipping always. It's really good, and I've seen a lot of people jump on deals that I post on my Instagram story. So. If you're interested in stuff like that, follow me on Instagram. Thanks for watching and um, going th uh, with me through my uh, pr uh, thought process. And I'll see you on the next one. See ya.